Hey everyone! So today I want to do a video on asthma. And asthma is another one of these conditions that medical doctors think that there's no cure for. And it really has got me scratching my head because there is a cure for asthma and it's called detoxification. It's called ridding your body of the massive amounts of toxins that have built up over the years, causing you to not be able to breathe correctly. Wherever you have toxins and genetic weaknesses and acids, wherever they may fall, if it's your lungs, if it's your bronchioles, whatever, you're gonna have issues there, okay? And yeah, so let me just get started. I have notes here. So asthma, that word actually originates from a Greek word that means panting. And, you know, like I said, even today, traditional orthodox allopathic Western medical doctors think that the cause of asthma is just totally unknown to them, you know, just like any other dis-ease in this Western world, people think that they fly in from planet Zircon and they don't know where cancer comes from, they don't know where any of these things come from, headaches, allergies. So asthma, just add that onto the list. They don't know what the cause is and they certainly don't have a cure for it. How interesting. So the treatment for the symptoms of asthma is um, oral or inhaled corticosteroids along with a host of other things. What spurred me to do this video is I stumbled across an article by Ro Gallo and she was just telling her story about how she used to have asthma and for 25 years she was on these medications and she was dying from asthma. So after 25 years of being on the asthma treatments, the doctors pretty much admitted that the same medicine that was keeping her alive was also killing her. So she decided to take her health into her own hands. And that is something I am so passionate about, is, is not relying on these medical doctors to heal you, because they won't, because they're chasing symptoms, they're chasing the cure. Um, it's, just, it's just crazy. You're never gonna find a doctor that's gonna tell you to detox, and if you do, let me know. I mean a medical doctor. So she discovered that her disease is preventable, and that the cause of most diseases is what? Toxicity. Really important that I talked about in a recent video is she figured out that the mind and emotions play a huge role in health. So she started to believe that she could get better. Because remember, after all these years, the doctors told her, you know, there's no cure for this, you're not gonna get better, and you know, that can put a lot of negativity into someone. You know, I have never been in that situation. I've never had a medical doctor tell me that I'm dying and that I can't get better. But she figured out that the mind is so important and she started to believe that she could get better. And it took just two weeks on a water fast to flush most of the toxins away from her body. And guess what? She could breathe again. And she said that the moment that she could take a breath and not have any pain, she started crying. And I can't, I mean, that just touched my heart because I've never had asthma, I've never had any breathing problems. It, two weeks on a water fast and it healed her, okay? And she also worked on her breath work using yoga and visualization. And um, breath work is a whole nother topic that I would love to study more. Um, breath work is very, very interesting, and um, it makes sense that she used that to help her as well. So now, she eats a diet of mainly organic fruit, and you guys need to look her up. Her name is Ro Gallo, and it's just an amazing story. So she took the responsibility for her own body, despite what the doctor said. And she also, something that takes a lot of bravery and a lot of smarts, is she went against everything she was told. That's pretty much with anyone who detoxes, really, if you think about it. She went against that there was no cure and that she was gonna die from this, and she is alive and well today. So that story is just amazing to me. And, it's, and another thing that I wanna mention with asthma is that you know breathing problems stem from the adrenal glands. So chances are 
if you have asthma, your adrenal glands are shot and you got to fix them. And with the adrenals comes the kidneys. And with the adrenals and the kidneys comes cleaning out the GI tract. And also, I would recommend the three lung tea from Dr. Morse to start hacking up this mucus because really, this is a mucus problem. This is a toxicity problem. So you have to eradicate that from your body. And yeah, and I, I have heard of so many stories from people who have gotten rid of their asthma from doing juice fasts as well. So water fast, juice fast, and detoxing with fruit, you know, that can unleash all of the toxins. Also, get off the dairy. If you're eating any kind of dairy and you have asthma, oh my god, <laughs> get off the dairy because dairy is pure mucus and it is just a pure clogger. Um, so yeah, that's my video on asthma. Look into detox if you have this because you can get rid of this and you don't need steroids and you don't need a medical doctor to hold your hand with this. It just is what it is. So yes, that what I'm saying goes against the grain of what you've been told if you have asthma, but you gotta look into alternative ways to healing. And really this <laughs> detoxing is not alternative. It's just in this twisted society right now, it's called alternative. Really chemical toxic prescription drugs should be the alternative. If you've tried everything, then going to the toxic things should be the alternative, but it's not that way in this society, <laughs> unfortunately. But yeah, that's my video. Click like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.